hello, Hamitor here. Right, so I started Athens, not Athens, Rome 2. Uh, again, playing as Athens, following on from, from my previous series, um, which is going to now be a series rather than I stopped it there. Um, so, to fill you in from what happened quickly from this part, and the last part, and I say quickly as it's actually been many, many hours. Um, I have expanded a little bit, and the world has come to a different shape than it has in like real time. So I'll start explaining a little bit. Okay, so I've now got a little bit of Europe. I know this technically here is Europe, but this bit here. Uh, then I've also started going into Asia, and at the moment I've I, I have one corner of the map, and uh, uh, many struggles, many battles. I now have uh, 24. There you go. Everything in this color is mine. All the blue are my allies, and all the red are my em enemies. So, I have to just try and defeat these guys at the moment. Everyone else at the m I'm against are rebels, so after I take this bit I want to go for um, Egypt, because then I can kind of get this area down, get the Suez Canal done, sorted. But I'm just trying to think about something quickly. I have also got a lot of client states. When in my previous game, I think I accepted Rhodes as a client state, and they have spread out a little bit more. This this bit here, they've got Asia, which is not actually Asia. It's just it's supposedly where Troy is. Is like here, I think, or here, one of these two. Uh, they still have Rhodes, and they also have this place here um, so they have a little bit of like Syria there you go I'm glad that it's written there so I know what it is um, no then they're, they're not my client states Th these guys here uh, the Trillis they're my client states as well what happened is I think I originally owned this in that part but they went rebel um, I couldn't be bothered to the to do the fight or auto attack it and I lost and then um, I I get to the rebel bit in a minute as well um, then I attacked them with an army and decided that it would be easier if I just made them a client state and so I did and they've just kept their their there you go uh, I think that's one of my generals no that's not that's uh, yeah he's just protecting that base there um, Egypt oh, that's an ally that's an ally that's why um, Persia, the state is uh, not the state. Sorry, the um, the country is my client state as well. Uh, same thing, pretty much. Rebels, I took it back over. Decided that it'd be easier if they were just a client state. Did it like that. Um, same with Partha. Actually, no. They. What happened was I took over these two. This is a city, this is a town. I came in, took over this bit first, and then moved in. Um, and they brought an army up here, took that, and then another army up here. While well, I was literally one turn, I moved down here, and they had an army here. I was just away from attacking them. And then they moved around and took my town without me even being able to take it, so I was like, fuck it, I'll just take the sea. Um, yeah, so then I had to end up taking this sea, and I was like, well, I want to take them captive, so they're my client state as well, and same with these guys, 
Um, so that's what's going on. But right, rebels. I have got a lot of rebel uprising in my ta uh, my my country. I am auto resolving most of them because I get a lot of them, and I mean I, I'm getting like five a turn. But it's good because it's good XP for my guys. It means that they level up quicker. Um, some of my armies are my my highest army is um, level nine, and they're all like level seven and shit like that. A lot of my places are in like pissed off, and I don't know why because I've got a lot of food. I I had armies there, but that didn't seem to stop anything. Um, I yeah, I don't know. I think there might be agents there, but I just can't see them because they're really good. Um, these guys are an ally as well, quickly. Um, okay, a little bit of history of the other map. I will get into playing a game in a second. Um, so, I'm sorry if this seems boring, but I just need to fill you in what happened. Uh, I haven't opened this much of the map yet. I'm just leaving that. But Carthage have lost Carthage, Carthago, even if I'm pronouncing that right, wrong, I'm really sorry, to rebels. Um, so, they lost that, they've got this place down here and they've got one of this island they should, I think, no, Punic Rebels have that, okay, I'll leave that, forget about them um, and Libya have kind of done that, Egypt's gone, Egypt's lost this place, I want to get this so then I can extend this, I've just gone about that, blah 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 um, and I'm going to take this as well once I've got a lot of armies over here that I'm going to bring over here, I know that's that that sounds really shit tactically, <laughs> like explanation, but um, yeah, that's best I can give it because I don't need I I need just one guy protecting about this region, one guy protecting like this region, this region, this region, this region. And then I can have like three guys going on to attack, so I can take over this place because they're rebels. They're not exactly. Um, I don't think entirely that they work together. Like they're in, they count as an independent state. I think they're just different. Ord yeah, I don't even know. So, but first, what I'm gonna do? This is this is what this series is about. Rome. Rome has gone fucking nowhere. It is literally gone fucking nowhere. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over. Yeah, when I've taken this place here, subjugated it, and I'm gonna subjugate Rome. Give it loads of money. Tell it go to, to go to war with people, and make the Roman army literally my bitch because what the fuck is it doing, it's not doing anything, it, it didn't even expand, come on man, I want uh, I want to fight some Roman legions that are decent, that not that aren't like shit so I'm gonna go over, take them over, give them loads of money and wait like a hundred years, I will skip that bit out, I'm not gonna because it took me like three days so that will probably end up being it in the next series um, so yeah at the moment taking this and then hopefully here and here and I'll let sit, let Rome go this way and that'd be good okay I'm just gonna oh yeah I've got this guy I can't move see rebels this guy's dying he's not really but you might as well. Okay, they're not rebels there, that guy's seizing my shit. I can't even raise a fleet there, that's bollocks. Oh yeah, that's because I'm going to take this and this is going to be my port town here. 
like I'm a military town, which means that I can send a fleet round to help them because I've still got one provincial thing. Um, I'm a max level as well. This is pathetic. I I swear on one of my games, this was like the armies it was like 24 armies I could hold. Ridiculous. Maybe it's only because it's Rome. And maybe only Rome gets that, but that would be really annoying. So I want to just end the turn quickly. Um, get a quick look. Oh, that's one of my decent armies. So I've got Carthage. Um, the Sulicids. I think, no, I'm not pronouncing that right. Um, I did take them as a client state, but they rebelled. And so did uh, another place, but I I didn't have an army down there to go and um, extend into their territory. So I had to leave it for them. But I did have another place that rebelled and I managed to take them over. And instead of making them a client state again, I just took it over and left it. Okay, people aren't. And they're moving. Okay, uh, I'm tr I gave people loads of money to make them happy. And this is not what I wanted. Okay. Uh, there's no point. Okay, so it's only one army. I could fight fight this. Uh, what is it? Pikeman, 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 pikeman. Swordsman, pelvis. Okay, I could do this, but I might. Uh, yeah, this is good. this is gonna be dodgy. Dodgy as fuck. But I could get this. Yeah, I'm gonna fight this. I'm gonna fight this. Like, it doesn't seem like that big of a battle, but... I know. If I was on the other team, and I was controlling the other guys, I'd be like, this is gonna be a piece of piss. Because I would literally, I would use those cavalry to take him out those mobs. And then go on to his archers and pelts, and uh, use the spearmen, not the spearmen, the uh, swordsmen, to take out the um, spearmen, my hoplites, and that's it. I wouldn't even need the pikemen. But my idea is, oh, and they had to give me. Oh, okay, okay, I'm gonna have to draw back a little bit. Okay, the thing is, is I'm going to have to try and work this in my van advantage because they've got more space than me. Right. I have upgraded my navy to f so I've got quite um, the best navy, the best army. Um, Hoplites at Athens in whole get like fucking shit all. Their special units is one actual special unit, and the others are Peltis and Hoplites. It's like that's that's bollocks, mate. That's bollocks.